is the last day of in-person early voting in Douglas County, and early ballots have been coming in for some time. Officials say more than 100,000 early ballots were sent out, and as John Chapman reports, election officials here expect as many people to vote in person tomorrow. Many voters in Douglas County aren't waiting until tomorrow to cast their ballots. Well, I had the option to vote early uh, because of my, my job, and so I, I came out this morning. I always vote a day before election or prior to that, and I'm just glad to be an American citizen and able to vote. Whatever the reason, thousands of voters have made their way to the Douglas County Election Commission's office to cast their ballots before election day. You know, there's no question that during the pandemic, voters became much more familiar with early voting. So in the presidential general, we had 63% of voters voted early. This time around, I think we'll be pretty evenly split. Officials expect anywhere from 102 to 105,000 voters to go to the polls and cast their ballots in person. Already 102,000 early ballots were given out to Douglas County voters. State law permits us to count early votes today on Monday. Now, we never see the results. I don't see the results until like 7.30, quarter to eight um, tomorrow night, right before they get pushed out to the public. So we've had about 80,000 early voting ballots turned into our office already, and those are all ready to be counted. So we will count those today, and then the results will be stored in our vault until tomorrow night and those will be the first results reported at 8 p.m. Over in Pottawatomie County, early voting not as brisk as their neighbors on the other side of the river. Early uh, voting is kind of uh, down from where it was four years ago, about half. And I couldn't tell you why. One of the uh, parties that normally sends out request forms to their uh, party members did not this year. That might have been one reason. Melvin Hauser is the Pot County Auditor. He's hoping the lack of interest in early voting doesn't carry over to Election Day. The Douglas County Election Commissioner is expecting a 57% turnout for this election. Which would be on par with 2018, but midterm elections before that have been in the 40s. On your side, I'm John Chapman, 6 News. Douglas County election officials say as of this morning, about 20,000 of the more than 100,000 early ballots requested in the county have yet to be returned.